Oh. Feels so dramatized. Oh. Hello? All right, an up and coming production. Oh. Well, calm your jets there, Larry. Uh, yeah. Shape up. Mm. Oh, you should put that away. It's danger of working out without sh uh, closed toed shoes. Yeah. Larry Six, everyone. There's a lot going on. Oh, we've got pre credits. There's our low. The one man band himself. A nice sort of jazzy big band uh, intro. I shouldn't be talking over it, maybe, but I'm going to because that's my want in life. Oh, hello. Uh, sharpened pencils are always good. I, you know, I foolishly thought it was going to write something instead of exploding. Um. Hello, Dad. Oh, you have many talents. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> this is a very, what the? This is a very odd intro. Uh, I don't even know. There's probably some sort of age security that's gonna come up, and I'll have no idea how to do it. Uh, are you gonna explode? To nope. She's fine. Character design and babes by Ruben Huante. Brilliant. Wow. Oh, look at a little animation, dog. Hi, Williams, and whatever the other one was. There are a lot of people here. I didn't think this many people worked on this game. Uh, what the? Oh, well, okay. Uh, so it looks like my I'm not needed here. We can just kind of go on without me because they're voice acting. Uh, well, there's a lot of voice actoring. I just said voice actoring. That's the term, voice actoring. They're voice actorists and they do voice actoring. Uh, oh boy. Yeah, it's like a full cast. Okay, well, this will be fun. Oh. Okay, I've got controls. I think we're in it. Straight up, they don't care. They figure if I sat through all that, I'm old enough. Ah, another busy summer day. You decide to wander down to Muscle Beach to work out. Of course. Your as a eyes oogling babes. That is a babe. I could oogle the dudes too, I guess. Uh, right. Lost in your work, you nearly miss the Hollywood limousine that pulls in behind you. All right. Whoa. Hmm. Long hood. As Hello. The limo stops. A beautiful blonde emerges from the sunroof to announce. My name is Shallow, and I'm looking for one very good man. All right. <laughs> Out of the way, Bob. Let me at her. Move it. This is all good. Show, well, I Never guess mind. you have to do. What's your name? Uh, acting. Gross. My name is Larry. Larry Laffer. <laughs> oh, oh, hell. Classic. Good enough for who it's for. <laughs> Brilliant. Ah, oh, the joys of Hollywood. Just pick it up, random creeps off the street. Oh. Yeah. I didn't think they had any trains left in LA. After a few glorious moments in the back of the limo, in which you right. act out your favorite scene from No Way Out while Shallow acts out her favorite scene from Ice Station Zebra, you arrive Great. at the studio and are escorted directly to the set where an episode of Stallions is being taped. All right. And don't worry uh. about thinking up answers while we're taping. We took the answers you gave us earlier and had our writers heat them up a little bit to make them acceptable to our uh, sophisticated viewers. Oh, good. 
So when it's your turn to answer, just read your cue cards and you'll be just fine. All right. I don't but remember. Wait, Shallow, I didn't give you any answers earlier. Yep. <laughs> I haven't gone out with these women. In fact, I've never even seen them before. Uh, welcome to Hollywood. Oh, don't worry, Lasser. Stallion number two is going to lose anyway. No. Yeah, that works. Places, people. Places. Lights. Playback. Oh. In five, four, three. Hi, from somewhere near Hollywood, California, it's the latest and greatest in embarrassment television. <laughs> Stallions! A little slow on the cue there. Today, featuring right. three hot young fillies from the Mensa chapter of downtown Pasadena. Hello, folks. And also oh. featuring two of the hungiest stallions we could pry away from Venice Beach. Yep. And now, let's all A wild a beast, that Larry. Star of our show. Let's get a burst Stiff. out of the butt. Oh, no. Stiff. Hello. I am not a crook. Uh, why does he? Okay, it doesn't look like Reagan in the close ups. Uh, Welcome back, everybody. Let's meet oh our contestants. Looks like a corpse, actually. Stallion number two is a professional bodybuilder and part-time out-of-work concrete form dismantler who credits his physical success to Herbabite. Let's hear it for Larry Laffer. Those are all descriptors of me. Stallion number one is also I guess a professional that... bodybuilder and an apprentice right. condom sizer who guarantees oh. that around him, women come first. Really slam them together Brilliant. for rock hard. I guess Did the gentle C show? sounds are clapping. We recently had a dream date with each of our three lovely fillies. Cocktails at sunset, a romantic dinner under the stars, dancing by moonlight, followed by a trip back to the stall for a little heavy breathing. Yeah. Oops, I'm sorry. I meant heavy breathing. <laughs> yeah, for a comedic part. And now, get let's meet better. our three little fillies. Philly number one is a nuclear chemist specializing in zero-gravity right. liquid-fueled propulsion systems who has a mainframe computer right in her very own home. Yes, that's right. She really is a rocket scientist. How about some oh, animal fun. noises for Dr. Sharla Maine? Philly number two also hails from Pasadena, where she leads a think tank specializing in international economics, monetary systems, and currency stabilization. Get it off for Dr. Sharla O'Hara. There's some quite successful people. Again, and that's finally, not clapping. Philly number three is one hunk of prime horse flesh. With PhDs in marine biology, subatomic nuclear physics, and film studies, a woman oh. who expects more from her man than just intelligent conversation, hoot it up for a while for Dr. Sharla Dan. Oh, all people named Sharla. Common name in Pasadena, I suppose. I'm sure you huh. all know the rules, so let's get right to the game. Larry, you're first. Oh, goody. Uh, am I in charge of anything, or am I just Me? observing? Uh, I don't know. I'm not really prepared. Well. Uh, what the hell. Uh, I'll take Greek mythology for $500, Alex. That's about all of this we need to see, isn't it? Let's fast forward. Yes, thank you. Uh, and we're back and with our God. contestants. Larry, what now? Um, could I buy a vowel, Pat? Yikes, this is not going well. Let's cut to oh, the chase. This is a complex game show. And the winner of today's show, Rock Hard! Yay! Rock and Charlotte win an all-expense-paid cruise down the lovely Mexican Riviera with stops at Tijuana and Juarez. Ooh. There goes the boat, real quick. I've already done one of those. It was a nightmare, so... And our second prize goes to Larry Lapper. Immediately after the show, you'll travel by Studio Limo to the exclusive health spa and resort La Costa Lata, where you'll spend a wonderful two, some expenses paid, weeks. Oh. All right. 
Thanks for watching, folks, and be sure to tune in again tomorrow for another episode of... <laughs> Stallion! All right, they were a little bit more on time with that one. When I was a whirlwind of a start, uh, sometime I'll get into a game. I, I feel like I'm being dragged along, but I guess that's normal. Rock, honey, here's your tickets for the cruise. I'm afraid Charlotte won't be going with you. She opted for the cash payoff instead. That's but fair. You won't be lonely. I'll be waiting for you in your cabin. Whatever. Fair enough. You come with me, doofus. Hey, this is what you get for not that's vetting the strangers you get. Yeah, that's fun. Here's your limo, lasser. Enjoy the ride. All right. Wow, what a cherry 73 pacer. Finally, your All luck right. has changed, Larry. Two weeks at an exclusive health spa filled with gorgeous women. Uh, that La wasn't part of the deal. Here I come. I think that might just be projecting. Health spas, in my experience, are quite diverse and usually filled with older people. Not that older people cannot also be attractive, but I don't think that's what Larry here is quite interested in. The heck. Given everything else we've seen in this series, I don't think he has any qualms about anything. Okay. Well, this is a lovely pink building. Ah. Hello. Uh, I seem to notice my uh, control bar is no longer grayed out. Does that... Oh, it does. It's a little... Okay. A little bit on janky side. Well, everybody. Welcome to Leisure Suit Larry 6. Uh, 12 minutes into the epi... Hello, sir. It's a mighty machine you have there. Uh... Yeah, Larry 6. Uh, the last Larry game I have and probably will play, because this is, to my knowledge, one of the last ones that Sierra was heavily involved in yeah, before they got weird. What's this stuff in my hand? You know, I don't know, Larry. Why are you looking at <laughs> Why is everyone looking at me? That's unnerving. Uh, does this still pause things if I hold it up here? Let's watch for desk person to shuffle papers. Nope, doesn't pause it. Okay. Yeah, so. Let me say shape up or, sh or slip out. Could be ship out. Uh, we're here in this health spa and hilarity is going to ensue. Welcome to the front lobby of La Costellata. It's plush and heavily carpeted, yet with an underlying cheapness and shoddiness that makes it unconvincingly decadent. Well, perfect. Speaking of which, where's your toupee? Uh, looks like it's still on top, but I don't know. Uh, let's look La at this. La Costellata furnishes an electric tram to shuttle its aged, tired, or lazy patrons around the hotel. All right. It only appears to be a toilet on a skateboard under a beach umbrella. Sure. I mean, that's the styling I'd go with. Uh... I'm just gonna... La Costellata allows its preferred customers the convenience of this quickie checkout deposit box. Those lucky customers simply deposit their room keys. It's all on the honor system. All you, right. of course, are ineligible for this program. Eh, hey, well... That's fine, I'm sure. So, okay. My guess is they're gonna maybe deny me a room, but there are room keys in there. Look at this bin. A quaint old ashtray sits beside the reception uh, counter, reminding customers of those halcyon days before smoking was illegal. Eh, well. Uh, look at this the eyeballs. This tacky chain-link chandelier is a monument to bad taste. You feel right at home. Okay, well, at least I'm being put down by God, so that's pretty fitting. Uh, hello. The woman behind the front desk is a real knockout. Although you can only see down to her waist, what you see is what you like. Well... Oh, hello. Okay, so it is still you have to look at them before you can speak to them. That's noted. So I didn't just have to sit through that. Uh... 
Ma'am, why are you primed to remove a, a receptionist duties? Hello. Good day, miss. My name is Larry. Larry Laffer. <laughs> I'm here as a guest of Stallions, that famous television show. Eh. How do you do, sir? I'm Gammy Boisule, head of human services and customer relations here at La Costalada. All right. My job is to make sure your visit here is everything your heart desires. And Lovely. less. Okay. That that's achievable. I appreciate that. Uh I guess we I keep... suppose we could yeah. begin by checking into my room. I do have a room, don't I? Presumably. Oh, but of course, Mr. Laffer. Stallions has taken care of everything for you. Here's your key. You're in room oh. 201, one of our finest suites, right at the top of those stairs, conveniently located near the ice machine, elevator, and kitchen exhaust fans. Oh, good. I'm sure you'll find it well worth the price you paid. Well, I paid nothing, so... Say, baby, what oh. time do you, uh, get off? <sighs> Usually, right after I get in bed. All right. Uh, uh, what was the question again? You know, I don't think there's much more to glean from this. Uh, I assume exit doesn't mean exit the game. Uh, okay. <clears throat> well. So we have a room key now. Uh, my inventory is just up here instead of a separate screen. That's handy. Uh, let's look around this desk. This Just counter to... is where the hotel receives strangers as guests. Hence right. the name, Reception. Makes sense. Welcome to the front lobby of La Costalata. It's plush and heavily uh -huh. carpeted, yet with an underlying cheap... Speaking of which, okay. where's your toupee? That's unimportant. Right. What does this door do? This door bears a tiny brass plaque with the delicate La Costalata logo and the words... Manager's office, employees only. All right, easy enough. I guess we go up to our room. Whoa. <laughs> up to the room in a hurry. Uh, let me just... Oh, boy. This is game. Save-O-Matic. Auto-save, TM. Controls. Filth. <laughs> Um, okay, speed. Oh boy, I missed the little sliders. They made much more sense. I assume that's low speed. Let's set our throttle to medium. Filth to maximum. Music could knock it back a bit. Does the detail slider... Let's set detail to maybe maximum. I think my computer from 30 years in the future can handle it. Wow. Much higher fidelity now. Um. Right. Let's look around up here. I gotta say, maybe this has been always the case. It's been a bit since the last Larry game. I feel much more confused than I think I ever have. I think it's just the, all the colors, all the noises. I'm like being dazzled. This hall contains only one guest room, an ice machine, and a private elevator. Ah! A large glass wall at the far end has a security door that effectively blocks your admission to the Costa Club rooms down the hallway. Fair enough. Whoa. Guess the ice machine's well, running. let the chips fall where they may. All right. How considerate. La Costalata has placed an ice machine right here for your listening pleasure. Ah, oh, how sweet. And the elevator and the vents, they said. Ah, oh, lovely time. Well, can I fiddle with this? Because it just made noises, so... While you could press the button on the ice machine and cause ice to spill out all over La Costalata's expensive carpet... Ooh. You won't. Uh, never t tempt me with a good time. While you could press the button on the ice machine, you uh, won't. It won't let me. 
That's fine. I assume this elevator is this not for me. This private elevator leads up to the resort's penthouse suite and Ooh. is not designed to be used by mere plebeians like you. Ah. Uh, only the advanced can use an elevator. Uh. Do I use this hand on key? This is the key to your room. No. If you stick it in just the right place, it might do you some good. All yeah. right. I wish I had a dollar for every time I've heard that. Yeah. Do I pick it up? Okay, I pick it up with the little piggy up thing. I assume this is my room, because it's the only one here. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, and what a room it is. Alright. You'd hate to have to match the pattern on that carpet. It's a little garish, but... Ah, the autosave. Uh... Yeah, let's go. Oh, look at this. I'm using my own save system instead of the uh, DOS box one. Everything, my entire resolution did change when I booted this one up, so I wonder if it's in a slightly different... Uh, different system because these are all to operate on the modern time they're all emulated uh welcome to la costa liota no la costa lotta it's probably costa not costa but i can't change it now so save yeah that's fun. I don't think I've used the in-game save. Actually, I don't know if some of the other ones had in-game saving system. No, the last Larry game at least did. Um, look at the desk. The red oh. housekeeping services card reads. This. Uh, La Costa Lada is pleased to offer an exclusive complimentary turndown service for our more sophisticated customers. Simply touch 75 on your room phone. All right. Normally you have to dial it, but I will just simply touch it. Great. Ah, exit. Um. Think of all the trouble hello? that woman went to, just for the chance to look into your room and maybe catch you undressed. Oh. Gosh, what a trouble. Um. Well, I'll, I looked at it, so I'll take that. The red that. housekeeping services card reads. Or not. Okay. What else is on the table? Your coffee table looks a little crooked. But hey, around here, who doesn't? Yeah, that's there true. There are three small colored cards on the coffee table. Okay. So these are each... So what's this blue thing? The blue spa Touch services it. card reads... Uh, La Costa Lada is pleased to offer these exclusive services for our more sophisticated customers. Again. Zip away fat in our electroshock exercise center. Dip into our stimulating Euro mud baths. Experience the high colonic thrill. That's it? <laughs> I do like a high colonic thrill. Uh, enjoy the dry heat of our Swedish sauna. Uh, note, Dr. Swinebutt's world-famous cellulite drainage salon is temporarily closed. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Alright. Well, what's behind card number three? Uh, I gotta go around for this one. The pink telephone services card reads... Uh-huh. Ah, the phone registry. Uh, welcome to La Costa Lotta. Touch eight for long distance, nine for local... Zero for front desk, 71 for room service, 72 for bell desk, 73 concierge, excursion desk, 74, excursion desk, I don't know, uh, housekeeping, 75, and maintenance, 76. I'm probably going to need to know all of these. Okay. What's this purple button? A small switch conveniently placed on the glass wall near your bed is labeled Magic Massage. Okay. I do like magic. You hear what sounds like a small elevator going past your room. Oh, lovely. Uh, I guess I could go out and... Oh, hello. 
Uh, I could go out and look and see who's come out, but I think I'm good. This door bears a tiny brass plaque. They could be going with a up. delicate Lacustalata logo and the words "bathroom." Oh, lovely! Yeah, it was a log cab ride. It's always good when you get into the hotel. Pop in. Ah, bold and all all windowed toilet. Uh, okay. Now hold on. So this is a mirror above the toilet. There's a second mirror above that, the sink. Why why have two mirrors, especially when the toilet they've put this mirror on glass above the toilet specifically. Also these flowers aren't reflecting, but that's fine. Uh what's this bathroom? Well, your bathroom is small. It is complete, and what a great view. Brilliant. I don't see a shower, but I guess it's... Maybe you don't do that in health spas. Uh... Okay. Hey, I just thought of something. Remember back in Lost Wages, in Lefty's bar, in his bathroom? Remember when I found that diamond ring lying on the sink? Remember oh, yeah. that? Well, I do. Great. I remember that too. I don't remember what we did with... I think we gave it to someone. Uh, which is probably not great, because that was probably someone's ring. Though, knowing most of these games, they're probably scummy. Uh, well, let's use the can real quick. You flush the toilet. Good boy. Perfect. Wash our hands. Uh... Yuck. The water coming out of the sink is brown. Mmm, chocolate milk. It's just health water. Well, that's not quite right. Um, I guess we could go call maintenance. If I'm going to be staying here for two weeks, I don't want the, uh... I don't want the water to turn my hands into a rusty shade. The pink telephone services card reads... Yes, yes. Uh, maintenance 76. Let's touch the phone into 76. I'll take the long way round. Sit in my phoning chair and... Yes, hello, this is building maintenance, landscaping, and grounds. May I please uh -huh. to be helping you? Hello? Sure. There's brown water coming out of my bathroom sink. Is there anything you can do about it? Ah, yes, but of course, Mr. Laffer. I am so sorry. Let me send up mm. one of our best men. Right away, pronto, soon, quick, quick. Oh, and please to okay. be accepting our sincere apology for any inconvenience and perhaps if you are suffering. Ah, perhaps I can make some adjustment to your bill. Please, just a moment while I check the computer. All right. Oh, I see. Never mind. Uh, Mr. Laffer, I'll be sure to send up somebody sometime. Maybe in a few hours. Maybe never. And please, don't bother calling back. All right. I appreciate the prompt service. Uh, distasteful voice acting. All right. Hello again. Think of all the trouble that woman went to. Just yeah, for a chance yeah, yeah. to look into your room and maybe catch you undressed. I've been you there hear before. the obnoxiously loud whine of a compressor emanating from somewhere below you near the kitchen. Hey. Ah, they really do their number to make sure you know this is a crummy room. Uh... Can I... Yes, I can save. Oh, I don't get to rename them every time? No, 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 that's... Not only is that not very fun, that's actually very dangerous because I am 100% sure I could still get soft locked, especially with what I'm about to do. Uh, yeah. This will be the beginning of the end, or the end of the beginning. Uh, because we're about out of time here. But, I just wanted to save that real quick because I'm desperately curious. What'll happen? Oh. 
It uh. sure feels shaky. It does. Is this just it? I figured it would kill me. Uh. Without a trace of fear, you brazenly attempt to remove the do not remove under penalty of law tag from your pillow. Oh. Man, this threat right. is strong. Not surprisingly, you fail. Wow, I'm just a rule breaker, huh? Uh, right, well, nah, we'll leave the bed doing that. Okay, so yeah, this is uh, Larry Six. We're on this journey. I'm very confused. I don't know what's happening, but it's about normal. All right, well, thank you everybody so much for watching. Feel free to check out any of the other stuff I've done, and until next week, bye-bye. Oh, hello, bouncing person. Hey, you out there! Stop checking me out! <laughs>